Hey y'all, I'm back. It's me. I know y'all miss me. <laughs> Look, so I wasn't even gonna speak on the situation, but I know everybody has been DMing me and asking me what's been going on. You know, did me and Mo break up? As y'all know, some of y'all know, we did break up and y'all could see he been posting videos or whatever about the situation. I wasn't gonna talk about it, but now I'm gonna talk about it because this motherfucker think he could pull up with some flowers. And think I'ma just accept him back to open reach. You got me fucked up. You got me all the way fucked up. I ain't accepting shit back. He was entertaining bitches while I was pregnant, while I was having a miscarriage, everything. He was just talking to bitches. And I found out and he acted like it was nothing. Like you feel me? Like I saw I was logged on to his iCloud on the laptop and I saw everything. I saw multiple, multiple bitches. He was linking them talking to them or that you know you know what happens when niggas link you know you feel me but like it is what it is like i don't got time i don't have the energy i know my worth and that's why you cannot just pull up with flowers and think i'm gonna accept you back and mind you he's over here acting all cordial and stuff on youtube but then in real life acting like a crazy ass motherfucker because I'm going on dates. And and y'all crazy too. Some of y'all is crazy too because y'all sitting here sending him the address to where I'm at. So he could pull up on me and do whatever he want to do. Good thing I left. Good thing I left before he got there. Like y'all really got me fucked up. I don't belong to him. He don't belong to me. So why y'all sitting here sending him my location? Like y'all don't even know what time he was on. Y'all don't know if he was going to try to pew pew me or nothing. Y'all know nothing. But it's okay though. It's okay though, cause I'm healing. I'm done with the situation, y'all. Like I'm, I'm done. This raps. Like he cannot have me no more. Like it's gonna take way more than just flowers to come. You feel me? Like, but it's okay though, because I'm single, and I could do whatever the fuck I wanna do, and he can't do nothing about it. And I will slap the shit out of any bitch that try to play with me. <laughs> But yeah, so like, if y'all really want to know like everything that happened or whatever, he talking about stuff, the reason why he was talking about just because he felt neglected or whatever the case is. Nigga, shut up. Shut the fuck up. Like, you was doing it because you wanted to, because you felt like it. Like, he was going to do it. He thought he was being sneaky and he thought I wasn't going to find out, but I found out. And that's why he got no laptop now. <laughs> that shit is broke now. And it's crazy because he tried to log me off for the iCloud or whatever. It's too late. I already got all the screenshots. And you know what I did? I took, I sent him all the pictures of everything that I saw. And I saw even more, but I didn't get all the pictures and stuff. But I saw a lot. And yeah, he thought he was slick. I know his heart dropped when he saw me send him all of them screenshots of all the shit that he was doing, all the bitches he was entertaining. Even him and his man's conversation. I seen everything, okay? So don't sit here, y'all. And then y'all sit here and y'all y'all talk about, oh, it's fake. Y'all ain't break up. Da, 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 da. First of all, people go through things, right? So just because we broke up before multiple times doesn't mean that it's fake every time. It's not fake. Like, we people, relationships go through this. The only thing this time is, it's really done. It's really over. There's no getting back. Not from this. There's no getting back from this. Because you're not about to sit here and entertain bitches while I'm pregnant with your child and then having a miscarriage and then have bitches writing me on Instagram from fake accounts on some crazy shit oh like your man is cheating on you why are you pregnant your man is cheating on you da 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 you're whack da 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 bitch say it from your real account say it from your real account fucking stupid ass hoes you got you got messy ass hoes like you you dealing with messy ass hoes like at least at least be smart and deal with somebody who gonna hold it down and not snitch on your ass. You stupid ass motherfucker. That's what that's the thing about you niggas. Y'all niggas are stupid. If you're gonna play, play right. Don't get caught. Don't get caught. We got caught. Period. So now, since this motherfuckers got caught, them bitches can have you. You for the streets. Send them back to the streets where he belong and now look at him begging begging for me back now nah, you can't have me baby go back to the streets go talk to them bitches go give them bitches flowers 
not but you want me though right you want me though you want to act crazy in real life and then act like you all normal on youtube please boy then come to my door with flowers i'm sorry nigga shut the fuck up you ain't sorry you only sorry because you got caught you ain't sorry about you because you got caught motherfucker and this nigga want to be posting and shit tagging me on Instagram, bro, this shit is coin. This, this this social media shit is for the fucking birds, bro. I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm tired. That's why I didn't make a video until right now. I'm making a video right now because I'm over it. Like, I'm just trying to let y'all know that I'm done with his ass and tell his ass to leave me alone. Comment under all his videos where he decide he want to mention me. Say, leave Jazz alone. Leave Jazz alone alone leave jazz alone she don't want you no more she's done finished okay because i'm over it i'm over y'all commenting i'm over y'all saying this is fake i'm over y'all saying get back together we're not getting back together i don't care how much y'all love the relationship how much y'all thought it was goals or whatever the case is. it's done it's not goals y'all only see the cute stuff online but y'all don't see what's happening behind closed doors where motherfuckers is cheating like Please, okay, like I said, if he wanted to play, he should have played it smart. Because I found everything out. And it's probably more that I, I don't even know about. And it's cool though, because I already found out enough. I don't gotta sit here and figure every single thing out because what I saw was enough. Enough to leave that ass. Enough for this relationship to be done. And there's no coming back from it because the trust is gone. I don't trust his ass no more. I would never think, I'm gonna always think that this nigga is doing something behind my back. And he did it at the worst possible time. At the worst possible time. When I'm fucking pregnant with your child, and then when I lost your child, and you still same day talking to bitches, you're foul. You're foul. While I'm in mad pain, bro, mind you, while I'm pregnant, I'm, I'm having a worse pregnancy. I'm throwing up all day, every day, just sick, 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 drained, tired. And instead of having that support, that emotional support, I get cheated on. He wasn't, then that's why everything happens for a reason, because I didn't even have that, you know, support from his eyes. Like, how am I holding a child, but you're sitting here talking to this bitch, that bitch, linking that bitch, linking the other bitch. That's why everything happened for a reason. It wasn't meant for me to have a, some, a child by somebody like that, somebody who is not emotionally there for me not there supporting me nothing like and then he would be there here and there giving me a gift and giving me that night i need more than that i don't need fucking material things i need you to be here for me loyal to me no matter what not feeling oh because you feel neglected how the fuck you feel neglected because i'm sick throwing up every day are you fucking dumb like you're a fucking at this point like it's like you deserve i don't know what the fuck you deserve but it's not me it's not me. The fuck? Nigga, che cheating ass niggas, bro. Like, I really... And it's crazy because I know niggas going to do what niggas do. Like, I know that for a fact. Like, niggas going to do what they do. But, like, be discreet, bro. Be discreet. Don't get caught. Play the game right. Wrap it up. Whatever. But you stupid, you sloppy, and you got caught. Sloppy and dumb. At the worst point time possible like and now you want to sit here and beg for me yeah i know you begging for me back because you know i'm a good ass woman i've been a good ass woman to you and you ruin that for the hoes for the streets for bitches who don't love you for bitches who don't care about you these bitches don't give a fuck about you that's why you're over here begging crying for me back because these bitches don't fucking want you but you can have them bitches and them bitches can have you. So I'm over it. Fucking wanna pull up with fucking flowers. Flowers. What the fuck is flowers gonna fucking do? Shit not gonna fix nothing. Fucking bum ass nigga. Now, I don't give a fuck. I know he found a crib or whatever. Or whatever the case is. Or his shit is in his car. He gotta wait for the crib to be ready. I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I don't care. Anything could happen, I don't give a fuck. I don't can sleep on the streets for all I give a fuck. For all I care, I don't care. I don't care about the nigga. I don't care about the bitches he was talking to. Nothing. And I don't give a fuck. 
I just don't. And it's and I'm not saying like I don't love him no more. Like it's always gonna be love there. I mean like we was together for two years, so like I, like there's still love there. But I know my worth. I know what I'm worth, and I know he ain't he ain't worth me. He can't have me. He can't have me no more because like you're not about to do me dirty like that. And I'm about to sit here and just accept you back. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. And then it's like I'm giving like I'm allowing you. So play me like that. You know about to play me like that in my fucking face. Like I'ma just like I'ma just sit here and just accept you back. That's crazy. Like that's that's insane. Like imagine me seeing all that and then oh yes, yeah, okay. It's okay, I forgive you. Please boy. Fuck out of here. I ain't forgiving shit. He's not forgiven. He's not forgiven. He can't have me. I don't want him no more. Like that shit made me lose a lot of respect for his ass. I don't got no type of respect for him. I don't got nothing left for him. No feel like I love him, but like I'm not in love no more. I'm not in love no more. He made me feel a lot of love. And I don't know. Like I can't just say like, oh yeah, we never gonna get back together or in the future. Like I don't know. But as of right now, I'm done. Um and he could make it seem like he cordial about it, but he's acting like a fucking fool in real life. And on, on YouTube and Instagram and everything, he all acting like he don't give a fuck and he cordial and he's accepting and he's healing. But he's not. He's literally online. Like, he's literally in real life acting a fucking fool. He's fucking crazy. He's crazy. And it's okay, though, because let him be crazy. I'm gonna let him have his little ones. But, like... Soon, I'm going to get a restraining order on that ass because he needs to leave me the fuck alone. He won't leave me alone. I had to change my phone number because he won't stop blowing up my motherfucking phone. Like, stop calling me. There's nothing to talk about. You said sorry already. I don't forgive you. Matter of fact, I do forgive you. I do forgive you. I don't give a fuck about you no more, though. And that's that. And I'm not, going to, I'm not speaking about the situation no more. I'm not talking about this shit no more. I don't got nothing to say about him. I don't got nothing to say about them bitches that he was cheating with. Them bitches is dirt. All them bitches is dirt. All them bitches is trash. Them bitches is not me. Would never be me. Could never be me. And that's it. Like, played himself. Played himself for these little stupid ass bitches. Little thought ass bitches. The fuck out of here. So, yeah. I'm done with your ass. I know you're watching this video. Fuck you. Fuck these bum ass flowers. Fuck them bitches. Fuck whatever you got going on. I don't like you no more. I don't want you no more. I don't want to be with you. We done. Like, there's nothing else to talk about. Don't bring me no flowers. Don't call my phone. Don't do nothing, bro. Don't text. Don't DM me on Instagram. No, don't make no videos about me. Don't make no videos about me because I'm done, bro. Like, this situation is done. It's finished. Find something better to talk about. Find something better to do. Then to mention me. That ass. Because you got me fucked up. Keep mentioning me. For what? Stop talking. Don't talk about me, bro. Leave me alone. Don't tag me on Instagram. Don't do none of that whack, corny shit. Move the fuck on. And heal. Like you said you're doing on YouTube. You said you're healing. Be about what you talk about. Because you pissing me the fuck off. Acting like you're one person online. And you doing the next shit in person. Like, get the fuck out of here. Anyways. I love y'all. I love my supporters. And I know y'all been asking me for a video, and that's why I did this video. But this is the last time I will be speaking about this. My content is going to be different. I'm going to be posting different shit. Everything y'all asking for. Y'all going to see me in the gym. Y'all going to see me getting ready. Going on dates, because you already know. Your girl is single. You feel me? I'm going to be going on dates. I'm going to be having fun. I'm going to be living my life. I'm going to be having a great ass summer. And yes, I'm healing too, but I could be healing and having fun in the process. While he's over there acting like he's healing, I'm healing in real life. You feel me? So, yeah. For my supporters who, you know, who've been rocking with me. And the ones that have been DMing me and showing me my love. And, you know, sending condol condolences from, like, the miscarriage and stuff and everything. Listen appreciate y'all i love y'all and y'all gonna see, be seeing a lot more of me way more often now because i'm about to start giving y'all what y'all want everything y'all been asking me for 
I'm finally ready to start posting and being more open and you know, you feel me? So I love y'all, it's Team Jess forever.